What's good, y'all? How y'all boys doing, man? It's your boy, King Superior. Hey, look, I'm not gonna be too long. I'm gonna make this video real quick for y'all boys. If y'all boys hear my neighbor's dog or parrot in the background, you already know what time it is, bro. All right, so in this video, I'm finna show y'all boys how to do the momentum uh, between the leg spam on NBA 2K21 on Ojin. Uh, so here we go. To do this move, uh, you need a certain you need certain animations to do to do this move. Um, <clears throat> so let me go into animations so we can show y'all boys what moves you need. So we need to change the what is it? The size up SK packages. Okay. Now you could you could only do it with a few of them. You could do it with Pro Six. You could do it with Pro Two. Most of the clips in the video that you're gonna be seeing, uh, I was doing it with Pro Two. Okay. You could do it Pro 2 or Pro 6. I'm not sure what other moves, what other ones you could do it with. You could try. I normally use Pro 5 because I get the very explosive behind the back. But for this move, I had to switch it up just so I could show y'all how to do it. So like I said, you need either Pro 6 or Pro 2. You could try both of them and see which one you like more. Um, I personally think Pro 6 is a little bit faster, but I'm not sure. I, ha I haven't really looked at it side, side by side, so it might be the same. I'm not sure, but you could try it and see for yourself. But yeah, size up escape, either Pro 2 or Pro 6. You could try some other ones. Pro 5 doesn't work, so don't even waste your time trying Pro 5. And uh, that's about it. Let's jump right into the actual tutorial, okay? Alright, so to do this move, um, it's pretty, pretty simple. Actually, I'll take that back. It's not simple. <laughs> if you don't know how to do it, it's not going to be simple. I always say that, but it's simple for me, but it might not be simple for you, alright? So in the actual clips, I was doing it a little bit slow so you guys could actually see it and understand it. I wasn't doing it as fast as it, uh, as you could possibly do. You could do it a lot faster than this. If you've mastered it, you could do it way faster than I was doing it in the video. But like I said, I was doing it a little bit slower just so you guys could get the gist of it, okay? So let's say the ball is in your right hand. What you're going to want to do is you're going to make sure you're holding RT or R2, whichever console you're on. Then what you're going to do is you're going to flick your right stick upwards. And then you're going to push your, right stick, your left stick diagonally upwards to the left. And then once he does the momentum cross, you're gonna release RT R2, whichever console you're on. Then you're gonna flick your right stick to the right. Then you're gonna hold RT again or R2, whichever console you're on. You're gonna flick the right stick up, and then you're gonna push your left stick diagonally upwards to the left, and just continuously repeat that process over and over and over. Okay. So let's say the ball is in your left hand this time. You're gonna hold RT R2, whichever console you're on. Then you're gonna flick your right stick upwards. Then you're gonna push your Left stick diagonally upwards to the right. Once he does the momentum cross, you're gonna release RT and the left stick, and then you're gonna flick your right stick to the left. And once he puts the ball between his legs, you're gonna hold RT R2, whichever console you're on again. Then you're gonna flick the right stick up. You're gonna push your left stick diagonally upwards to the right to do the momentum cross. Release everything. Flick your right stick to the left. Once he does it behind the back, you just keep repeating the process over and over and over again. It's pretty pretty simple. Um, like I said. You could do it a lot faster than I was doing it in the video. I just did it a little bit slower so you guys could actually see what I was doing. And I also slowed it down. I always slow it down, but still, I was doing it slower in the video. But once you master it, you can speed it up and do it extremely fast, okay? Hopefully, this video did help you a lot. Uh, if you want to check out some more uh, NBA 2K21 tutorials and stuff like that, I got a playlist in the description. It's called NBA 2K21 Tutorials and Tips. Y'all could go check that out. A lot more helpful helpful videos in there. Drop a like on this video. My name is King Sapir. Follow me on Twitch. I'll be streaming on Twitch sometimes. And I'll see y'all boys later, man. Peace.